In September of 2018, 48-year-old Todd Gradunsky put on his Packers jersey to go out for a day of partying. He went to three different bars and guzzled shots of hard liquor and plenty of beer while watching football. In total, he was reported to have taken 16 different drinks. Then he got into his pickup truck and ended up slamming into a car being driven by 25-year-old Angela Wimmer. She was badly injured and died in the hospital just hours later. Todd was arrested shortly after the crash. His blood alcohol level was still high an hour after the crash, but you won't believe what the craziest part of this case is. Todd had been arrested for DUI in the past, not once, not twice, but six different times. In the year 2000, he was arrested twice, then once in 2001, twice in 2003, and once in 2007. It's hard to believe he was out of jail, much less had a valid license. Investigation found that in case after case, Grudzinski got lucky. Plea deals, reduced jail sentences, cases where he avoided DUI charges altogether. You'll be shocked to hear just how much Todd was able to somehow get away with over the years, time and time again. Two